Hey there, Becca here from Inside the Square. In this tutorial, I'll teach you how to create a landing page in your Squarespace website. A typical landing page doesn't have a header or a footer. The goal of this page is to get your leads or anyone who lands there to convert by giving them one main action. To do that, we're going to hide the header and footer using code injection. The code I'm using today is listed in the description below, and I'll show you exactly how to add it because there are two unique ways to do this. The first way is to select edit on your page and scroll down to any section. As soon as you see this plus sign anywhere on your site, click on that and select code. Here we'll leave it in HTML and we'll paste the code that says style dot header comma footer display none and then we'll close that code with the word style. Again, this is listed beneath the video. When you've added that, go ahead and select save and you'll notice when this page refreshes, the header is gone and the footer is also gone. Now what we did was use code injection on the page, so it might take a split second when this page loads to hide all of that content. If you'd like to change this using a business or commerce plan, we can use page header code injection instead. I'm going to hop into edit mode, hop into that code block we created, and remove the code that we pasted there. You'll notice as soon as the page refreshes, the header and the footer of my website have returned. Now, if you're on a business or commerce plan, you can navigate to pages and select this gear icon next to the page that you want to turn into a landing page. From here, scroll down to advanced and place the code right here. Now, why would you want to do this instead of a code block on the page? Your page header loads before the rest of your content, so you won't have that split second lag where the header and footer will be visible while the page loads. When you're all done, select save. The page will reload and you'll notice our header navigation and our footer are gone. Now let's review those two options one last time. If you'd like to install this on the page itself, select edit. Scroll down to any section on your site, even this first one here. Wherever you see that blue plus sign, click on that and add a code block. From here, paste the code that's listed beneath this video that says style, period, header, comma, footer, display none, and then closes that style bracket. We'll go ahead and select save. Our page will reload, and you'll notice the header and the footer are now gone from this single page on my site. I'm going to hop into edit mode and remove that code so I can show you your other option. We'll go ahead and select save. You'll notice my header and my footer have returned. If you're on a business or commerce plan, navigate to pages and next to the page that you want to turn into a landing page, click on that gear icon and select advanced. This is where you can add the code to the page header so it will load before the rest of the content on your site. Select save and you'll be good to go. And again, just a reminder, pull this page into the not linked section of your site if you don't want it to be a part of your main navigation. For more tiny tutorials like this one, visit InsideTheSquare.co.